All right, boys. Uh, five o'clock a.m. I'm at my dad's house, picking him up. Still dark. We're gonna go look at a used walk behind. Um, I saw one popped on there yesterday. I saved a little shortcut on my phone. Boom. We're gonna go go look at. It. I got the cash in my pocket. It's an X Mark Turf Tracer. So let's go see it. I'll get y'all some video once it gets a little brighter. <laughs> It's about two hours away. Sorry, that's that's the other part I forgot to mention. It's five o'clock, but um, he's got to go to work, the guy. So I'm gonna try to be there about seven. So that's what we're doing. All right, guys, what's up? So this is Tony, and uh, like I told you here this morning, we looking at this mower right here, and uh, so. We're gonna do that and uh, we're gonna test it out. I've never really had one of these or really driven one. Dad's gonna get some footage for me. When we got here, I wanna, I smelled some brakes and my caliper's locking up or something on that, so we gotta get that fixed. But um, but anyway, we're gonna give this thing, we're gonna give this thing a shot and my dad will video me running it. Hopefully I don't crash it, things like that, so. All right then.
right guys we got it um so what i did was see i don't even have ramps or anything um because you know i run zero turns and in my opinion you know ramps are dangerous for going in your truck on a on a rider you know because if it falls off or something you're in deep dookie but since i got this uh walk behind and i didn't even have ramps so i'm like what am i gonna do so i was looking last night like mom maybe bring my trailer or whatever but it's two hours away so what i did when i was looking i was like wow this gate i could just slide it off my 14 foot trailer and that's what i did i slid the gate off i'm using it using it like a ramp but um but when i got to the guys the hubcaps in the truck he took it off but when i got to the place uh where the mower is i'm like man what is that smell i hope that ain't me um you know at the guy's house where we bought the mower and sure enough one of my brake calipers is sticking or something on my truck and man it's bad so we're at a a place where where the the guy that i bought the mower from um he uses this shop to do work on his trucks because like i asked him like you know who do you use you know to do do stuff and uh this is the place the shop they uses so we called them and came down here and they're gonna put it up and see if we can get this brake thing fixed we gotta get back home but man a little inconvenience for sure i got a lot of yards to do but what do you do you know it's just part of the long care lifestyle i guess it's real life and uh the mower's the mower's great um it does have a you know a little bit of an oil leak and stuff um but i got a great deal on the mower he sold to me for two thousand bucks so you know it'll be great for me to just try out the mower try out this platform of mower and see if i like it and i figure if i get it for that price um you know it worked out good for him it's fair for him you know to get rid of it and it's good for me because if uh it's good for me because you know even if i have to put a little money into it i still didn't pay a lot for it so um you know a couple one of the seals on the motor or something might have to be done so but anyway that's what we're up to and uh you know let's keep moving so me and my dad are here and uh i'll keep you updated on the mower you know i wasn't i wasn't too good with it as y'all see in the video I'm, I'm not used to it but um but you know i'll have to get used to it over a little bit so all right check this out boys it's 104 inch i think 96 inch sorry but man truck's done 900 bucks we're back on the road we're here at uh cow nace and conyers and they uh they are at x mark place so i think i'm gonna go ahead and leave it here and have them because it was on my way home anyway it's about an hour away go ahead and have them check the oil le uh, leak and like you know make sure the deck's level and things like that and uh so that's what we're doing all right guys so it's gonna be a month or three weeks or something before they can uh, look at it the mower so i did not leave it um but i did get washers you know like this, the little inserts and stuff on the front forks to take some of that slop out of the front um you know because it has some slop on the front caches i thought it was just like the whole frame um but they do sell the little inserts so anyway so i got that and i got the chute for it because it doesn't have a chute you know i don't want it just blowing out so we got that too and uh so the journey continues on the turf tracer but we're going to keep working on it so see y'all later all right guys so 9 14 i'm back home um you know so i had to you know just to finish up this video i had to rush back um, and went out and did a few yards three four yards that i could till until it got dark and so i gotta wake up super early and try to get myself back on track but at least we got the mower and now we can uh start getting it the way we want it. and um so that that is a blessing so thank you